Hi, I'm David Douglas. I've been working with Makers for Good for the last year and a bit on the Heliolite. The Heliolite captured my attention because it's something that can be used off the grid, both for my own uses, camping and emergency light around the house and whatnot, as well as for people in developing countries who just don't have regular access to power. I'm going to talk a little bit with you about the charging on the Helio. First thing to notice is that the Helio has a solar panel built in. This panel is a high capacity panel that allows the light to be charged over a period of time to just basically in my usage stay completely charged all the time leaving it out in the sun um, for, for emergency uses. I also have an ability to charge it very very quickly using USB coming in and that charges the high capacity battery and there's USB out that allow charging of cell phones multiple times on a single battery charge. So I'm going to show the Helio lights and buttons and controls. There are two buttons on the Helio. One is for the flashlight and the other is for the lamp. If we push the flashlight button, flashlight goes on to the high powered setting, again the medium, again the low, and then the last time and it turns off. If we turn it on and press the other button, that of course immediately turns it off. The lantern, press once for high, second time for medium, third time for low. For the red light, I'm going to shine this on my hand rather than on directly to the camera because the camera can't pick up the red very well directly out of the light, but we push both buttons together and we get the high powered red mode. And that's quite a bright light in a, in a darkened room and yet your night vision is preserved. That's the medium setting and the low setting, which in normal light is pretty dim, but at night it's a quite useful light and at the power setting it's at, this setting will run continuously for a month. There's a flashing light mode we take both of these buttons, push them, and hold them for five seconds. Helio starts flashing, first on the lantern, and then on the flashlight. To turn that off, of course, you just push any one button. Helio has a stand that can be used to hold the lantern in place or to point the solar panel towards the sun. And it's got multiple positions so that for example, the lantern can be held up, the lantern can be held down, the lantern can be pointed at something very small so that you can examine things at very close range. Helio has on the stand a hole that's used for a variety of things, but one of the things it's quite useful for is there's a mounting clamp that put in the hole and then screwed down to a flat surface, a wall, table, holds Helio in place for semi-permanent usage. Helio comes in three colors. Redwood, Adventure Green, and Moonrock Gray. So I want to thank everyone who's helped on the light with the Makers for Good project that involves a variety of nonprofits, uh, companies that have donated engineering expertise, individuals who've donated time and attention. Uh, I think we've come up with a really great light and I'm really pleased with the people who help support this by purchasing it and knowing that a lot of the effort is going not just to providing lights for the people who are going to use them, in my neighborhoods, but people are going to use them around the world.